As some 200 people were granted Singapore permanent residency in the last three years through the, gov the country's Global Investor Programme, more than $5.4 billion through direct investments was brought in over the past decade. This created more than 24,000 jobs in Singapore. A Minister of State for Trade and Industry, Lo Yen Ling, added that the investors come from a wide range of sectors, including technology, sustainability and financial services. She was responding to MP Yip Han Wing in uh, Parliament. A leader of the opposition, Pritam Singh, asked how many of these investors become citizens. And Ms. Lowe said GIP investors form less than 1% of the total number of PRs approved each year. Of these, those granted citizenship are even less. For the GIP uh, individuals who are permanent residents, uh, does uh, EDB or the ministry track how many of them transit to being citizens? I can say that a very, very low percentage of the PR under the GIP has been granted citizenship. Now, I want to use this occasion to just elaborate on what I've mentioned earlier about us requiring the GIP investor to submit documentary evidence and EDB mounting site visits to validate all these numbers. I want to say that the GIP and PRs who do not meet the GIP economic and residency commitment as well as other renewable criteria will not have their re-entry permit renewed.